What is up guys, Mike Jamoom here and welcome to my YouTube channel and most of all welcome to episode 12 of my uh, Gothic 1 playthrough The Path of uh, the Dark God Balear In this particular episode we're gonna play and uh, do uh, the whole uh, Gomez thing as well as uh, reactivating your Ezio So without further ado guys, let's kick some Gomez's ass First check if he has some uh, interesting spells. Greetings. Greetings. I'm see At least this guy does say for the honor of magic. He has two demons again. That's better than nothing, but... See, I've already exceeded. I can miss 50. Nah, I can miss that. Alright, so... 20 learning point. Let me quickly go to the water. Uh-oh. Oh, sorry about that, guys. Alt tap. The uh, push talk button is from the alt. And inventory is tap, you know, so if I press them both, it's alt tap. But um, yeah. Let me let me quickly go to the water magicians. Hello, Milton. A lot has happened since we met the last time. I would like to tell you everything, but I don't have the time right now. I'm in a hurry. Milton, I need your help. What's up? How can I help you? Let's go somewhere where we can talk. Fine. Follow me. Greetings. May you return in one piece? That's really not my problem. Now tell me, what is it? I need the magic powers of the ore mound, and I don't think it would be a good move to ask the other magicians of water. You're joking! This is no time for jokes. I'm deadly serious. I've seen Zardas, the necromancer. I'm working under his orders. Zardas? You're beginning to scare me. Nobody has spoken to him since he left the old camp. I have. What do you need the powers of the ore mound for? I want to transfer them to this sword here. Wow, what a weapon. Its name is Eurytseal. Zardas gave me this magic spell to carry out the transfer. You will have to recite it while I bring the sword and the ore together. Hmm. Hmm. It looks as if I only have to read out this spell, but we'll get into trouble with Saturus and the other magicians. We'll have to take that risk. It really is very, very important. Important for all inhabitants of the colony. I don't understand. It will get us out of here. You have to trust me. All right. After all you have done for us, I trust you completely. Besides, it seems Zardis trusts you as well. Meet me down at the ore mound and don't tell anybody. Good. Let's meet at the ore mound. See you there. Not gonna do that yet, but uh, he will be ready when I need to. So let's go to Sharky, Kronos, any of the merchants that can give me a bit of ore in exchange for my goods. As well as check with Court if I can. I train my two-handed with 20 learning points. I think it's 30 and Hello. 40, but I'm not 100% sure. Do you trade in anything else? I buy furs and skins from the hunters. If you get something like that, I'll buy it. You don't have ore. Really, you don't have ore. And that surprised me, uh, Wolf. 
Kronos is a mage, so he definitely has no one. Some people it was obvious that there would be learned. trouble ahead. So let's talk with a sharky. Some people never learn. Dad won't Hello? Again. I need a few things. Let's talk about something else instead. You shouldn't believe everything you hear. Same old story. You don't have one either? Come on. This is Joe one. Ah. Somebody, you're in trouble. Good. That's how it goes. I like to be in his shoes, though. Must be something. Same old story. Every time. Let's talk about something else instead. Not much, but it's better than nothing. Maybe. Maybe I overlooked it, but I doubt it. People always talk. that would be cleared up ages ago. Almost did with this one, though, so it is possible. If you think, there was a time when things would have gone very differently, though. I doubt it's ever likely to change. That's not really my problem. Expensive weapon. Issues, though. That one too. Rely on somebody and you're in trouble. That's how it goes. Some people never learn. That's really not my problem. There was a time when things would have gone very differently. As long as I'm not involved. Okay. That won't happen ah, again. You're probably ah, you're probably right. Alright, so let's see how much it actually cost me to learn level 1 of two-handed weapons and level 2. Level 2 will be revealed once you learn level 1, but level 2 was uh, 40, that's for sure. So I think level 1 will be 30. But if that is the case, that's fine. Greetings. Greetings. Oh, you can't train me. Oh, that's, that's a bugger. Hmm. Well, F you then. Maybe, maybe if I wear, wear the water robe. Let's try. Greetings. No, no, okay. No two-handed it is. Alright, so let's go to Gomez. Hey you! What are you doing here? Scoot! Or I'll call the guards. I knew that somebody would try to get at us through the pentagram. But, unlike that traitorous God, smith, here. Stone, we don't need you anymore. Where is Stone? Behind no bars. no business in there. But you're gonna be six feet under in a minute. Get him, guys, and slice him up. What are you- Yeah, Basil! I'm gonna try to fuck with me, eh? I'll send all of you to the balayas around you. Dumb cunts. Got balls, man. Don't you fucking dare. I have come to get a revenge in the name of Milton. And that revenge is not gonna be pretty, guys. Oh, Gomez bugging us again. Can't skip it. Don't worry, Gomez. I will come for your sorry ass. Breathe. There were times when things would have gone very differently. 
Really? Don't blather so much. Oh, speed potion. Whoops. There was a time when things would have gone very differently. Totally idiotic. That won't happen again. Nope. That's really not my cup. Yeah, buzz up. Ah, oh, come on. Damn bugginess of this game. Same old story. Every time we something about that story out of Let's show these bogus who's balls. Kick their ass. What do you do here? I d do you s own? I get. Kill them, all of them. Coward! Come back! He's waiting, what a nice guy. While well, it lasted. Catch him, time to heal, goddammit.
It's better. All right. Well, I still need, you know, to train to hand it if I can find a trainer for it. Which at the current moment I doubt. Because Court doesn't want to teach me. Where's my one handed? I'm not gonna loot all the bunch. Fuck the loot. Send another troop of skeletons to have some fun. Keep, that will keep them busy while I rescue Stone. Now even though Torres got killed, it doesn't really matter. He's one of the important NPCs, you know, but it's not my fault he's not immortal. That's what I thought, my friend. Move! stone what do you want you don't look like one of Gomez's henchmen. You're right. I'm not with Gomez. Then how did you get here? Gomez had the key to the dungeons. He gave it to me. Are you trying to tell me you're the guy that wiped out Gomez? That's me. Boy, I never thought you had it in you. But I'm glad the dirty cutthroat finally got what was coming to him. But why are you releasing me? I just heard you've been locked away and I thought I'd take the opportunity of getting Gomez out of the way and rescuing you. Well, thank you. I'm much obliged to you. Come and see me at the smithy. We can talk there. I'll see ya. See ya, man. Let's see how the skeletons are enjoying themselves. It will take a while before that bugger is actually at the smithy. Day for Balear. All the blood, all the bloodshed, all the death, and the sleeper must enjoy too. Gotta do something while I'm waiting for that booger. I'll see. Go to the smithy, man. my own skeletons attack me. Oh 
wanna try to get that bug out of his bugginess. Let's sleep till morning, I must make him bug free. And is he bug free? No, he isn't. There you are. Move your sorry ass. What are you doing, man? Hmm? It's not really that hard, is it? There you are. I owe you for getting me out of that rat's nest, man. You know, I was thinking, there's not much I can give you, so I'll forge something for you. Maybe a ring or some such thing. Why did they lock you in the dungeons? Gomez, the bastard, claimed I was in cahoots with the fire mages. The only reason he didn't kill me is because I'm the best smith in the whole old camp. So he threw me into the rat's nest and only let me out when he needed me to make something for him. This is why I decided to join both the fire mage and the guard. Because then this would make sense, you know, he sold me a fire mage, some um, guard's armors. And uh, that way at least it makes sense, you know. Can you reinforce this ore armor for me? Sure I can. Hand it over and hang on a minute. Here is the reinforced armor. We're quits now. I'll see ya. And still my necro rope is better. Hello. Well, at least it's uh, maximum enhanced. Alright, so that's done. So, um... Mm. Let's see what I can get for all my goods at the moment. Greetings. May you re- Greetings. Show me your goods. Give me all your mana potions. Let's see how expensive that is. 31,000. Alright, so let's see if I can get that. Since I can't train two-handed weapons anyways. Goodbye. No, not Eurytio. Oh, that sword is better. I will wear that one. It's not that I really need that many potions, you know, but since I currently can't do shit with it, and since I looted quite a lot from Skip and uh, the Dead Fire Mage, I could use it to get some potion supplies. The only thing that I really need is the uh, mana potions. The rest, you know, not really. Don't sell these, you will need them. Um. I'm gonna keep one crossbow just in case. So that's gonna take a bit of time guys, my uh, apologies. But it has to be done. Rain of fire is enormous. Thirty ones are already exceeded, hey. Let me 
do remove one of the expensive swords because I still got lots of junk. second here. I only have to remove about one crawler plate. Where's the uh, crawler? Just gonna make sure that all the unuseful items are gone and I got some useful items in return before the uh, mages are gonna go berserk on my ass due to the fact of reactivating Eurizio. Stop rely on somebody and you're in trouble. That's I'm not how listening to all the blabbering so, yeah. anymore. Just gotta make doubly sure. Because uh, preferably I need ore, but uh, they don't always have ore. Let me, by the way, remove the rings. And you might wonder why, because now, since my character has enough stats to wield the best one-handed sword that I could possibly get, you can fully get a uh, necklace of mana, everything of mana. So that he can summon more skeletons and thus foster Hello. XP grind. I want to acquire magic writings. And since I cannot train two-handed anymore, I'm going to waste it into pickpocket. Why not? You know, could also waste it in mana, but that's for later. It was obvious that there would be trouble ahead. That wasn't now very that's clever. Ever likely to change. Some people so, 1100. And some people never learn. You shouldn't believe everything you hear. Now that's ever likely to change. May I pass through here? Hello. Hello. Do I want to. Do you have ore? I didn't think you did. Let's oh, talk no. about something else. All right, so let's recheck Wolf. And that's only ten magic. I think Zardas has a better one. May right. I pass through here? For now, it's better than nothing. Mana bonus. Mana bonus. Hello. Do you How can you have no ore, my friend? This really, really surprised me because he always have ore. But this time he doesn't. So the rest I will use to. Uh, well, there was a time when things would have gone very differently. To trade for summoning spell scrolls. So let's reactivate Eurizio. That's really not my problem. I'm getting closer and closer to the end of Gothic 1 and the beginning of Gothic 2. Some people never not go rushing into anything. I doubt that they're listening to all the flattering. If you think. Don't listen to all the flattering. There must be something about that story after all. Have you got the sword and the spell? Here, take the spell. Are you ready? As ready as one can be for this crazy plan. Then let's do it.
It's done. Unbelievable. The plain gray gem is shimmering bluish now. I doubt that's ever likely to change. That's a good sign. The magic powers of the ore mound really seem to be in the old sword now. Maybe. But our little operation here seems to have attracted some attention. Maybe. You should teleport yourself directly out of here. What about you? Don't worry about me. I'll think of something. Go now! I've got to learn mana slash uh, picking pockets. And uh, they're not gonna be uh, so friendly. So... I have 30 po learning points, which basically I can't do shit with. But that's fine, that's fine, you know. So let's just get uh, out of here. Slowly, slowly, you've won. I didn't want to do army. Where's Zardis's? It was obvious that there would be trouble ahead. Keep it to yourself, people. Greetings. I've reactivated Eurytsial. It's incredible. The sword has regained its former powers. Now you have a really powerful weapon. You said there might be a way for me to wield Eurytsial, though I'm a magician? Look closely at Eurytsial. You'll notice the big blue jewel in the blade. It contains the magical powers of the blade. If I remove the jewel, I'll be able to create a magic ruin, which contains the attributes of Eurytsial itself. A magic rune made from Eurytsial? In battle, the rune will be as powerful as the sword. But don't forget that only a magician of the Sixth Circle will be able to control such a powerful magic rune. Remove the jewel from Eurytsial. This decision is final. Do you really want me to remove the jewel? Yes, do it. Since it's what you want. Here, take the empty sword and the rune. Death. Well, basically the XP exploiting has no purpose whatsoever, but that's fine as well. I'm still gonna show it. Because uh, I totally forgot about the fact that I still have to find someone to train me either my mana, not that it's really needed, or my picking, picking locks, because Cord couldn't teach me two-handed weapon. But all in all, you know, it doesn't really matter. The only ones that I will keep is Army of Darkness, so I can use it to uh, overrun the Orcs. Do I? Oh dear. Let me quickly go to the Sect Camp and get myself... A spell scroll. No, I will, I will take the rune. No, telekinesis is Adonos in Gothic 3, so it's not really allowed. So I will just buy a telekinesis spell scroll, which is allowed to uh, get myself a uh, the statuette, you know, on top of the um, worship area. I think it is the worship area. So that we can get the statue at the Balear to open the gates. I want. I will purchase two just in case. Not that I need it again, but you know. If you 
second. I doubt that's ever likely to change. And we'll just use this area over here. Alright, so this is gonna take a while, Gouge. Um, shall I do it? I will do it in a separate video. I think that's better. So let me save. Now it's actually chapter 6. I will save over that in a minute. So I want to thank you guys for watching. And if you like what you see, thumbs it up. And subscribe to my channel. And if you do subscribe, hit the notification bell. And uh, if you want to see experience exploit part, you know, where I will summon all the skeletons, golems and demons that I have in order just to grind for the XP, even though that I'm not, that I don't need it, because I fuck things a bit up, but that's fine. But uh, if you want to see that, just make sure to check the playlist video, because it will be called some like bonus episode something, maybe preparation something like that you know but it will be uploaded to youtube of course but uh, i want to thank you guys for watching and i hope to see you guys next time feel free to uh, you know leave behind your comments positive negative thumbs up thumbs down whatever you deem worthy and uh i hope to see you guys in the next episode so good day guys